Well, I understand your argument, and I um, it's a it's a perspective that's shared by a lot of people. I, I just don't believe it's going to be rooted in uh, what actually occurs or how the sport unfolds or how the whole organization is NCAA unfolds in the next 10 years. Um, student athletes, I believe, are capable of focusing on their academics and on you know pursuing financial aspirations and dreams. I mean, I, when I was a student at UNC in person, I knew several students who worked a full-time job or worked at least a part-time job. And they also completed their rigorous academic responsibilities at the same time. I believe both can be coincide instead of one or the other. I also happen to know a few uh, students at UNC Chapel Hill that owned their own businesses. And with these student athletes, that's what they essentially are. They are, they are their own business building their own brand. And if those students were capable of, of, you know, balancing both, why can't um, student athletes do as well? They should be able to receive some of the profits generated by the NCAA. And I think they are fully capable of balancing that needed academic and financial uh, responsibilities.